We're at 170 Spring Lake Drive in Chelsea. Uh, you wanted to see it, I'm gonna show it to you. Let's start with the exterior. <sighs> Rough. This one's at 299, which is quite surprising to me. Um, I'm gonna try to keep my opinions to myself. It's gonna be hard. Oh, it's very musty in this place. Now, was this once a kind of cool house? I would say yes, it was once a pretty cool house. So, <clears throat> breathing is going to be my one thing that I'm gonna really focus on. All right, so these windows uh, are original. Somebody built these, they would have to be completely replaced. Probably this slider is absolutely garbage, but um, yeah, that's telltale right there view of this tiny little lake is nice um all the windows look like <sighs> they probably need to be replaced it's got a fireplace here this big front this room here is cool i mean the layout's nice this kitchen is uh you know <clears throat> nothing to be desired i'm not even going to turn the lights on that's what i think um cool ceiling Smells like it's been closed up for quite some time. Air quality meter is something I should invest in. See how fast I should be getting out of here. I don't think that I don't think the uh, electrics are on, which is going to be a problem in a minute. Um, wow. Okay. Hmm. That looks like. Uh, I would say there's water issues with the roof for sure. If you saw the roof at all outside, you would agree with me. This is, uh, has some interesting, um, yeah, who cares? Okay, so <laughs> this is a split level. As you can see, you come in, you go either up or down. If you were to go down, you would find yourself in this lower level. Ah, Ooh. all right, the ceiling is falling in. That's nice. It is a fake ceiling, so, but you could replace that. This walks out into a uh, a cliff with your uh, free free canoe and stuff comes with it, which is fantastic. You're gonna need those to get away from your house. Um, yeah, uh, there's a fireplace down here. I mean, like I said, that if, at some point in time, this was a pretty cool place. So there was, I think, two bedrooms upstairs. There's another delightful bath down here. Green carpeting had to have been in at some point. So there's two up, two down. Um, actually, you can put in as many bedrooms as you want once you tear this thing down. So that is my assessment. Oh, now I'm out into the fresh air. Thank the Lord. Let's just take a look at this land in case you wanted to tear this thing down. This, uh... Doesn't have much of a yard. but it is waterfront. Of course, if you put a big old deck right across here and then went down and then more deck over there, you'd have a lovely little outside space. You just never want to go inside. So that's my assessment of this house. I'm guessing that I won't find a buyer for it. Thankfully, it's not my listing. Over and out.